is sponsored by the Science Museum of Virginia. It's a creative space for young adults ages 13 to 18. It's called The Mix here at the Science Museum of Virginia, and it's super awesome. Matt Baker is mix master. I totally get it, and I'm totally <laughs> on board. Thanks for having us down in the space. You're welcome, thanks for coming. This launched a couple of years ago, so um, young people around the area have discovered it, mm -hmm. but for those who are just coming in or maybe just hearing about it today, tell us what is, how do you even do it, and what is this about? Sure, so The Mix is, like you said, a creative maker space for teenagers 13 to 18. It is a free membership, so any teen, teen who wants to sign up can do that, and they just fill out our form. They get their own personal membership card, which allows them to come down here and use our equipment, use our expertise and our mentors um, who are current VCU students, or uh, it allows them to check out the exhibits out in the museum as well, so they can have that experience. And Matt, there's a little bit of a whole lot of everything. There's a lot of stuff in here. The mix is a very apt name, so we have 3D printing, we have robotics, we have computer coding, we built our own drone and fly our drones, we have a CNC router, we do some dremeling and woodworking, so it's all over the place. Yeah, I was. we were talking about before we even got started, you've made your tie clip from the 3D printer that's here, and it's just a really cool right. way to have young people get introduced to science. Exactly, so you know, designing their own things and going through the creative process um, to get to whatever product or project end that they're after. And did I hear the price tag free? Free, membership? free membership okay. for all teens 13 to 18, yes. Really, really, we're really cool. Excited about that. I'm really excited about this. It's the time of year that this poor little lowly brick gets no love. That's right. And we put it through the ringer every year, but this year we're going to try a Dremel tool, which is new for me. So I'm going right. to put on my goggles because that's kind of important, all right? right? Yeah, that's a safety first, always in the mix. So, you know, we, we want everybody to come out to Fruitcake Science um, in December December 26th through 30th. Mm -hmm. um, and we thought that in the mix, because we're a maker space and fruitcakes are kind of like a, a block of wood, yeah. we would make a little stamp out of um, a fruitcake. So this stamp is, this is one we pre-made, it says, the mix, but I thought I would give you a chance to try your hand at dremeling some All kind right. of design in our fruitcake. Sorry, here. my inaugural run with the dremel. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, I mean, safety first. Yep. Oh! Alright, so it's going to start slinging that fruitcake around. The dirtier the better, we say in the mix. How did you get it so refined on that other one? I just feel like I'm taking a chunk Lots out of it. Lots of practice. So there we then, go. <laughs> there's okay. a, the design process. We had our teens actually kind of pin it out and design it on the fruitcake before they started uh, dremeling it out and cutting out the fruitcake itself. All right, clearly that's so. going to take till next year before I get some sort of a design going. But if we, we right, pretend so we can we can yours. take the the pre-made the one we put together, mm -hmm. put it in some paint right here, mm -hmm. and let's stamp it on our board to make a sign that says the mix, and it might be upside down So we've blown but. it up, we've burned it, we froze it with liquid nitrogen, and now we've made a handy craft with the... Uh, nice little stamp, yeah. With the fruitcake, I like it. And so that's really cool, but you know what? Apparently this makes, uh, it's a really good conductor, is that right? It is, so fruitcake is conductive, and we do a lot of kind of hand tool making, you know, kind of more analog type of stuff, but we also do a lot of digital creation mm -hmm. in the mix. So over here I have set up what we call um, a makey make and this makey makey is going to kind of trick this into um, thinking that whatever we touch is a key on our keyboard. So if you'll okay. wear this, this is going to ground you, not because there's any risk of shock, but because you need to be they connected always, to the circuitry. They always talk about bringing me down from the clouds, so <laughs> you're grounding me with the uh, tin right. foil, okay. So I'm going to ground you with the tin foil, hook you up to the makey makey. Again, totally safe, no okay. threat of electrocution. Okie doke. We're gonna get our space invaders up. Sorry, let me get my password in. Okay, password protected over yeah. here at the mix. We always talk about our digital safety. Okay, so here we have space invaders, and mm -hmm. this is just a simple game controller where you are going to move your character left and right with those two, and then shoot is this button, I believe. Okie doke. So I will hit play and you can start playing some Space Invaders. Again, I've and never if it played helps Space you, Invaders. You could also look at the computer screen too. Where do I go? What do I do? <laughs> so you're going to move. There you go. Touch the 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 fruitcake here. Mm -hmm. There you go. And if you look, you can see uh, it's only moving left and not right for some reason. Uh -oh. So there, well, we're shooting at least. 
Oh, I see where we are. So the benefit of playing uh, or making a controller out of a fruitcake is that it's pretty quick and easy, but the downside is that the fruitcake starts falling apart and we lose some of the conductivity. In so a way. This is part of the mix experience in and of itself, kind of troubleshooting, doing things trial and error to figure out what went wrong, what we can do better, how we can iterate that design process uh, another step further. Matt, so I'm what we have, yeah, that's not your fault, that's the old fruit cake. That's right, that darn fruit cake <laughs> needs a little help, but you There know we what? go, now you got it, now you got it. Oh, look at me go. We're gonna work on this a little <laughs> bit longer. The fruit cake will still be around next year, don't you worry about it. And this it. is an old fruit cake that we repurposed. I love it. Mix Master Matt, thanks for the preview here. Thank Appreciate you very it. Much. Making science fun at the Mix at the Science Museum of Virginia. I gotta work up a little bit more skill here on Space Invaders. <laughs>